let's talk about fibromyalgia. Now, fibromyalgia is becoming a more and more diagnosed condition. Fibromyalgia, according to the American College of Rheumatology, the symptoms of fibromyalgia within five years, within a five-year period of there being an injury to the upper neck. Now, you've seen this chart before. You've seen all of this, these different tender points throughout the body. And a person needs 10 out of 18 tender points where they're kind of touched or poked. And if they're tender in any of these areas, 10 of these 18 areas, they are said to have fibromyalgia. Now just look at this picture. Where are most of these tender areas? Well, they're in the neck and in the shoulders. And what I see in my office all day long is that people start with a problem in their head and neck and it's just the rest of the spine unravels, so to speak, and compensates to try to make up for the misaligned vertebrae in the top of the spine. Now, if you look up resilience in the dictionary, it means the ability to come back to normal after being bent, stretched, or compressed. That's exactly what the spine does. So here, we want to remove those layers, help the fibros, the fibrous tissues, the ligaments, to heal, let the myo, fibro my, let the muscles relax, let them chill out and go back to relaxing now that they don't have to be recruited into battle anymore. And over time, the algae oftentimes does go away. Now with fibromyalgia, there's oftentimes chronic pain, there's digestive problems, there's a lot of things that go into it. People are taking Lyrica, Cymbalta, nothing really seems to be working. Many times they've had needle injections, they might be facing a surgery, unfortunately. And so many times with people with fibromyalgia, the problem is coming from the top of the neck. So this is an area that we have to pop the hood, we have to see exactly what's going on, and it all starts with a good evaluation. Part of our evaluation here, yes, we do x-rays, and yes, we know that there's effects from taking x-rays, but I would rather know and not guess, so I take x-rays. We do a three-dimensional x-ray study here. Take an x-ray from the side, the front, and the top. We want to know if there's any asymmetries. We want to know to the thickness of a fingernail, a fingernail, because that could be the difference between you getting well and continuing to suffer. It could be the difference of us being able to take your misalignment that, for example, may be rotated you know, like this, you know, by two and a half degrees, that top bone in the spine, to get it back to maybe three quarters of a degree, all the nerves that we are freeing up just by doing that matters. So I do do the extra work by taking these very, very specific x-rays. My equipment is aligned for this specific reason. Kind of a little jungle gym apparatus here. Everything is perfectly connected in case there's an earthquake. I don't have to wonder if my um, if my x-rays are as accurate as possible. So again, we can't help everybody with fibromyalgia, but the people that we have been able to help, it was kind of like, oh, I should have tried this years ago. Like, comment, subscribe, and share. Prior Lake Spinal Care, 952-226-7222, or email us at info at priorlakespinalcare.com.